1,000 levels, my friend. I'm not joking. I'm serious. 1,000 levels within Call of Duty Black Ops 3 multiplayer. That is right. For those of you guys that didn't know, today a huge patch went live for Black Ops 3. Two gigabyte update that changed theater mode, supply drops, added new weapons, which I've already done a video on and we'll link them down below in the description. But within this video, we're going to specifically focus on the leveling and prestige emblems within Call of Duty Black Ops 3 multiplayer because this is a huge change that means if you like to grind out the game or if you've ever hit prestige mask on a previous Call of Duty game, you're going to be super excited for this one. So for those guys that didn't know, prior to the launch of Black Ops 3, David Von Der Haar teased that there would actually be additional levels or some sort of bonus or something to aim for after you hit prestige master within Black Ops 3 multiplayer. Come the launch of the game, Prestige Master was all that there was once you hit Prestige 10, level 55, you got the Prestige Master emblem, and it seemed like everything was over, right? Well, when I did a video talking about this previous, when it was first talked about, I said that the best way to probably do this would be to add just unlimited levels, almost, after Prestige Master, so that you stay Prestige Master, but you have a crazy, like, level next to you, right? And that is actually exactly what has happened Highly doubt they listened to me, probably just what they thought for ages, but now you can get Prestige Master level 1000 within multiplayer and you get some very cool rewards. So once you hit Prestige Master, you will then be uh, level 56 and you can continue to rank up to 1000 and you get rewards as you do so. So at level 100, you'll get the first Prestige for Call of Duty World at War, which is Call of Duty 5, Black Ops 1 and Black Ops 2. So that's pretty much Treyarch's most famous Call of Duty games. And every 100 levels, you will unlock a new Prestige for all three of those previous Treyarch titles. So... For example, level 200, you'll get the second prestige for World at War, Black Ops 1 and Black Ops 2, all the way up to 1,000. Once you reach 1,000, you get 10th prestige for all of the Call of Duties, but also prestiges 11 to 15 for Black Ops 1, because there are additional prestiges in that game, and then Prestige Master, of course, as well for Black Ops 2. Now, I'll bring up all the prestiges on screen here so you guys can have a look at them. I'm sure a lot of you guys never played World at War. World at War is one of the first Call of Duty games I've really got into and still has some fantastic looking prestige icons, but you can decide to use these if you want, and uh, I assume you have like a crazy level number next to your name as well. So if you jump into a game at this point and see someone that's like level 60 something, or basically a level higher than 55, and they have that prestige master rank, do not be confused, this is the brand new update, my friends. The one thing you're probably thinking is obviously the scaling system of leveling from level 1 to 55 scales, scales accordingly the higher you get, so the XP you need from level uh, 54 to 55 is probably the same as going from like 1 to te level 10, basically. It's a lot of XP. So if that's going to continue to scale, getting from level 999 to 1000 would probably be like a million XP. It'd be ridiculous. As far as I'm aware, I think level 55 to 56 is around 55,000 XP. I think that may stay the same. I think it may stay around 55,000 XP for every single level up to 1,000. I'll update the description for you guys if you get more information on that, but there's no way it can scale infinitely. It would be absolutely nuts. But it does mean that if you guys love to grind out the game, there's a, there's a crazy number for you to reach. And if you have already hit Prestige Master and are now hitting these additional levels, send me an image of you doing so and let me know when you unlock all these awesome additional Prestige emblems from World of War, Black Ops 1 and Black Ops 2 because it'd be really cool to see them in action. And I think this is just a very, very cool additional feature to Call of Duty Black Ops 3 multiplayer and makes me, who's only at Prestige, I'm almost Prestige 3 to be fair, like Double XP Weekend helped out a lot. Unfortunately, my super awesome camera just went ran out of memory, but as I was saying, essentially, I want to hit Prestige Master now and start grinding out for level 1000, because how epic would it be to have level 1000 on your name? It'd be absolutely awesome. So guys, let me know what rank you are right now. Check out that new video of the new weapons that I mentioned earlier today, and I've also got one final video of something pretty crazy to talk about as well, so stay tuned and make sure you subscribe. Cheers for watching, guys. Get ranking up, and I'll see you with a brand new video.